Here we have a dry charged battery, Maxion. Is it worth buying or not? What happens after you get one and how to deal with it? I'll explain in this video. So, what's in the box? The battery itself, a cover, and that's it. Some versions come with electrolyte. Special bottles that you just pop on top, press down, and they pour the liquid in automatically. But not in our case. No electrolyte included here. Now, about the battery itself, Maxion. It's sealed. I've already removed the protective film. Underneath are the fill ports. The film is there to keep dust or debris out. While you're working with it, make sure nothing falls inside. You get a warranty card, 12 months, and an instruction manual. As I said, there are no electrolyte bottles included, so you'll need to buy electrolytes separately. I've got a syringe, but you'll also need some kind of small funnel or cap to pour more easily. This is acid, so protect your eyes and hands. Wear gloves. I've worked with this type of battery before, so I'll manage. Best to do this in a well-ventilated area. If your garage is small, go outside. Mine's big enough, so I'm staying in here. Let's start filling it up. I don't know exactly how much it takes. We'll figure it out as we go. When it starts to overflow, we stop. My syringe is 20 milliliters, but it doesn't fit directly. So I attached a small hose. Even one from an IV drip works. I'm adding electrolyte, 20 milliliters per cell. Slowly, no rush. After 40 milliliters, the chemical reaction kicks in. You can hear it fizzing. But we need to top it up so the plates are fully submerged. In the end, I poured about 60 milliliters into each cell. After that, as per the instructions, let it sit for 3 hours, then give it a 30 minute charge. Let's also test it under load. I've got a headlight bulb. Connecting it. And it works. Voltage drops just slightly. That means the battery handles the load well. Now, pros and cons. Cons. You'll need to mess with adding the electrolyte yourself. Some versions come with it. Check before you buy. If it does, you just attach the bottle and it fills everything automatically. Pros. The battery's lifespan starts the moment you add the electrolyte. That's not the case with gel or AGM batteries. They could have been sitting in storage for a year or two and be dead right out of the box. Not a risk with this one. So, is it worth buying? That's up to you. If this video helped, hit that subscribe button. See you next time. Woo!